My BFI player choice this week is a cult classic 80s shocker from Brian Yuzna, a brilliantly satirical slice of subversive body horror that waited three years for an American release after playing to rapturous applause at prestigious horror festivals in London and Sitges in 1989. Today, it's widely regarded as one of the most influential genre films of its era, the echoes of which continue to reverberate around contemporary dark fantasy cinema, society. You okay? I'm sure. So you want to tell me what's going on with Blanchard? I don't know. I'm jealous, I guess. He just wasn't the right sort for me. Could you zip me up, Billy? Something wrong? Based on a brilliantly witty script by Woody Keith and Rick Fry, society puts scrungy flesh on F. Scott Fitzgerald's oft-quoted maxim that the rich are very different to you and me. Well, just how different is something that will be discovered to his cost by Bill Whitney, the film's hapless anti-hero, memorably played by a fresh-faced Billy Warlock. Having cut his teeth on self-portrait in brains and produced the gory Stuart Gordon hits Reanimator and From Beyond, Yusner took the directorial reins on society. Inspired by the plastic realities of David Cronenberg and Wes Craven, and more interested in surrealism than formulaic but saleable slash affair, he teamed up with Japanese effects whiz Screaming Mad George to create a cinematic vision that owes a debt to Dali's The Great Masturbator, dark, twisted, and horrifyingly amusing. Making memorable use of the Eaton boating song and climaxing in a scene of matchless weirdness, Society makes you proud to be a horror fan, filled with such wit, substance and sheer on-screen strangeness that it continues to thrill and delight 30 years after its creation. Yusner will go on to direct Bride of Reanimator, Return of the Living Dead Part 3 and The Dentist, as well as working on the ambitious Lovecraft adaptation Necronomicon. But Society remains his enduring masterpiece, a film that turns its subject matter inside out, literally. 